Hey guys, today we're gonna do a seafood boil. I'm allergic to shellfish, so I can't eat any of this. So my mom and dad are gonna eat this. Okay, here we go. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, it's not fit. He's dead already. He died on the way home. <laughs> Hope we can still eat it. Put this in there too. Yeah, it fits. We need a big pot. We do. I think he's ready to come out. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah. There we go. There we go. It looks good. We have to turn the lobster down. Ow, it's hot. So we have corn on the cob, we get some broiled scallops, um, sautéed in some melted butter and garlic, a boiled lobster, boiled king crab legs, some large shrimp. Jinda has her sauce which has melted butter, garlic, uh, barbecue sauce, hot sauce, and I have my butter which is just melted butter, some paprika, some lemon juice, and I think that's it. Here comes our lobster, crab legs, king crab legs, the shrimp, the shrimp in the eyes like it. Squeeze a little lemon juice on the scallops. I want some of this one. I'll let you crack mine open. <laughs> oh, I will. Oh, look at this. I'm gonna try these scallops. They shrunk up. They were pretty big before. They shrunk. You gotta get a jumbo scallop. That was like a mini scallop something. Pretty good. Oh, look at that. We got mm. these at Walmart. Here. Alaskan king crab legs. It's cracking. Scrumptiously umptious. Let's try my sauce. I made my own sauce. Mmm. Yum. I like my sauce. <laughs> I like the king crab legs. Mm-hmm. You want one more? Sure. You can have that one. Get some corn in the cob here. You know what's easy is they already cracked the, the crab. See? That was good. And you don't have to do much work on it. Alright, I wanna I'm gonna crack this for you. This is probably gonna be messy. See it's really easy. You should just Oh well, did you have one yet? Yep. You did? Mm -hmm. Alright, I'll have this one. It's a pretty decent size. I want to try this one. My butter is hardened up a little bit. Oh yeah. It's not melting. I'll try mine. I like the king crab legs. Mm -hmm. Nice and sweet. Yeah. Good. Yeah, I think I'm um, no. This is my second time they have a king crab leg. 
remember. These are frozen. It would be nice to have them fresh, but that's pretty much impossible. Yeah. Here. There's another one. Oh my gosh. It's really easy, see? It's just because they already cut. I like my sauce with the curry. The king crab legs were $20 for two people. It's not bad. It's worth it. Yeah. I like that. We still have lobster to eat. See? They just come off. It's, it was nice that they already cut up. You gotta try some of the scallops. Yeah, I will. I'll try some of the shrimp. Shell peels right off. Mm -hmm. They look like they've been deveined already. Just dip it a little bit in butter. Oh, we forgot about the thing. <laughs> the muscle. <laughs> oh. <laughs> we forgot about the muscles. So we, we bought a muscles today, but it's okay. I think this is enough. <laughs> we forgot. Oh well. I like my sauce. I love it. I like it. Mm. The shrimp really doesn't have much flavor. After you've eaten a king crab leg, mm, yeah, it's kind of plain. I try it. You, you can have that. What happened to your butter? I don't want to try with the thing on this one. Mm, I like my sauce better than that one. It's alright. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> we have the lobster here. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Now you're going to find the most meat in the tail, of course. And the easiest way to get the tail off is just give the lobster a twist right here. I use a scissors knife. Break off the fins in the back. Oh, scissors. Kitchen scissors. Oh my gosh, I'm... I just oh, give them a poke. <laughs> All right, the make meat a mess. will slide right through. And you have all that beautiful tail meat right there. Mm. You can cut that in half. You can have half, I'll have the other half. Okay. There we go. We're sharing the tail with the lobster. No, I've always been a lobster lover. This has been like my favorite food my whole life. I'm going to compare it with the king crab legs. <laughs> my hands are all messy. Messy. The two are very different. They're both very good. The king crab legs are sweeter, but the lobster has a different taste to it. Mm -hmm. But it is good. You want to try my sauce? <laughs> I'll try a shrimp in your sauce. So I'm going to save mm. the lobster just for this my butter because I know I like it. Now there is a little bit of meat in the fins here in the lobster tail. Some people suck it out. I think it's a waste of time. Yeah. 
Same with these legs. Some people suck the meat out of these. I think it's a waste of time. So with these, le these legs, arms, oh, yeah. just give them a twist. Oh my gosh. They come off. So they still have mitts in there. Mmm. And this is the cutting claw. This is a little bit smaller. Oh, that hurts. Because of this spike. This claw is larger and more muscular. You know, of course, has more meat. Two more claws. You want more? Sure. See, it's really easy. I like this better because some of the king crab legs is that they don't cut it for it. Yeah, like in a restaurant. Yeah, you have to crack it. No. So you still have meat in there. Oh, gosh. Mm. Last one. <laughs> Make a mess. <laughs> mm. It's so good. They're very, very good. Alright, what are we gonna do with this thing? Crack that. You have to cut it with the scissors. You still have meat in there too. Shells went to the I think this one is not a soft shell or something. <coughs> this is not Oh my gosh. The ones um, more north of the coast of Maine, close to Canada, have harder shells because the water is colder. Mm. This one is hard. And we really don't have the right tools. We really need the tiny little forks to poke at these uh, arms. so hard. Uh, it won't come off. Ah, finally. There we go. I'm cranking it for you. See that guy? Ah, that's in a big ball. Mm. <laughs> it's yummy. Mm. It's a good thing we didn't cook the mussels because I'm starting to feel full. Yeah, they still have more shrimp in there. Got a lot of shrimp sitting here. Got scallops. You haven't touched the corn on the cob yet. Yeah, I'm busy. I'm gonna try it. Is it gonna have to Mm-hmm. You just have pushed in there. Tiny little scallops. Dripping. The garlic added a lot of flavor to the scallop. Yeah, I add garlic more in it. 
You gotta try the shrimp with my sauce, it's good. Ah. Can you see about my sauce with a string? Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is hard. This is hard. I mean the crab legs was was not much work but this lobster some people will take the shell off the body of the lobster here mm -hmm. and eat this stuff inside as they call tamales it's green it's, it is edible but you know what <laughs> you want to eat it I don't want to eat that. Uh -oh. Come on. This is the last one. Last lobster claw. Push all the meat in because the the shell is hard. Let's see if they will come out easy. Mm. <laughs> Go ahead, you eat it. You done? I think I'm gonna wrap it up here. Did you try the scallops? Um, not yet. I'm not full. It doesn't want to come off. <laughs> I still have meat in there. It doesn't come off. I want to try the scallops now. Good, my sauce. Mm. They're just too tiny. That's the problem. Yeah. They're too tiny. They're not bad because of the collar. The garlic and the butter. Mm -hmm. Not bad. I like my, I like this shrimp with them. This. You still have that. I'm done. We get a lot of shrimp left over, but Who I wants think to I'm eat full. This head. They still have meat in there. See, that's a meat. This is our seafood boil. Why doesn't Annalisa come on in and close us out, say goodbye? <laughs> she was watching this whole time. Come over here, this side, this mm -hmm. side, or behind us, in between. Where'd you go? <laughs> Just say goodbye to everyone. Too bad you can't eat shellfish. <laughs> You're allergic to it. Butter. I wish I can uh -huh. eat it. Ooh. Say goodbye. Thanks guys for watching. Bye. Thanks guys Bye. for watching. Bye. Let's have some lobster. How thick is that butter? <sighs>